All right, if you're into true crime, 2020 is likely on your list of things to watch. And tonight's story is about a missing Colorado mom who, it turns out, was living a double life. Yeah. Now, cameras weren't allowed in the courtroom of her trial, but Lubbock's Robert Garza was there. It was his job to sketch pictures of everyone to help news crews report on what happened. And tonight, that artwork featured again on 2020. KMAX Laura Lawhead got a chance to see how talented Robert really is. Yeah, Brian and Lauren, Garza is not only an artist, but he's also a healthcare worker here in town. He told me that ABC reached out to him two weeks ago to do sketches for tonight's show. And this is actually not the first time his work was featured on the network. To some, this might look like just an empty page. But for artists like Robert Garza, this piece of paper is a portrait waiting to be set free. I like telling stories. I like to catch their emotion, their eyes, their mouth. He turned this blank page into a woman's face in seven minutes, and the sketch just scratches the surface of what he can do. There's Frankenstein and David. Garza has drawn and painted his whole life. When I was a little kid, any blank paper was not safe. He loves capturing the likeness of things like pets, celebrities, local legends. I think you know this guy. This is Buddy Holly. Fallen heroes, and religious figures like this one of Jesus and Mary. Now his latest project is courtroom drawings for ABC News. But with those, time is critical. And I go as fast as I can trying to capture it. It started five years ago when TV stations asked him for courtroom sketches. Then those caught the eye of ABC. Friday night, his courtroom illustrations of witnesses on the stand in a murder trial once again appearing on 2020. I was at the edge of my seat. Oh, they used that one. Oh, they used that one. The recognition has Garza feeling a little nervous but excited. The artwork on a TV screen that everybody sees, millions of people see, it freaks me out. Freaks you out in like a good way? In a good way, yeah. But the talented artist is also humble. Wow. I'm, I'm very honored, you know. Very, very, very proud that, that I was able, after all the years of doing it, this is what's come out of it. Now, if you're interested in seeing more of Garza's work, you can head to his Facebook page or you can find his email on our website, everythinglubbock.com, by the end of this newscast. So talented. Laura, thank you so much.